good morning. Um, yeah, I woke up <laughs> uh, to not having a job. I quit my job this last weekend. Anyways, um, this is a get ready with me. So get ready with me um, to go get my hair done. I'm getting my hair done. I'm getting all this bleached. I know everybody loves my ginger hair. Um, but yeah, sorry for the background noise. I'm drying some laundry. Um, I do have a little blood mesh this morning. It was actually there last night, but who cares? We're gonna do a little bit of makeup or whatever. So first I'm, I'm gonna go in with my skincare with The Ordinary, I just got this. It's the Absorbital Gly Glycol or whatever. My best friend turned me on to it, it's for anti-aging. And I just did my nails last night too. Pretty cute, right? So I'm gonna take you guys with me. I'm not sure what kind of style video this is gonna be, but we're gonna play with it. It might be vlog style. I hope you guys are okay with that. Um, I'm just going to put this on my face or, and then we're gonna moisturize and then we're gonna start on some makeup. <clears throat> I'm kinda kinda go with something a little bit neutral today um, just because my hair is gonna be so vibrant so I want my hair to be like the star of the show, if you know what I mean. So, so we're gonna put this on, rub it in. Um, I'm gonna try to go quick with this makeup too because I have some other um, things I have to do before I go. So I'll be updating you guys along the way for what I'm doing today. <laughs> So if we get a coffee, I'll stop and get a coffee and share that with y'all. Um, I think it's like a thing like where chicks like, <laughs> I've been watching like a lot of uh, hair videos, like well, hair vlogs or whatever. And they get their coffee before or after they do their hair. I think it's before. So they have a coffee while they're waiting there because my appointment's gonna be like for five hours. So I might wanna bring a snack, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so I'm gonna let that sit and then maybe let's get this new little fan for makeup. It's pretty nice. And it has three speeds. It's pretty nice. Okay. That's nice. <clears throat> okay. And I just got this new uh, moisturizer from Neutrogena. It has SPF in it for my trip. And I probably should use this on the daily anyways. <clears throat> but I have a room. I'm in bed. So I'm gonna put a little bit in here. Oh, and I cut my thumb on a, if you're wondering what that is, I cut my thumb on a freaking wine opener last night when I was, I like to drink wine sometimes when I'm like doing my nails or stuff like that chat with my friends and I wasn't paying attention and my finger got caught in the, in the twisty top anyways that's no big deal and then after today I'm leaving tomorrow to go to Disneyland um I'm thinking about doing a Disney kind of come with me little video I got a piece together like edits and stuff it will be really fun You'll see my son in the video, and then you'll also see my boyfriend. Uh, my new my new boyfriend, he, um, we just started dating in November of last year. He's so sweet, and he's in a band, and he's, yeah, he's just a sweetie pie. He's really weird like me, has a green mohawk. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna stop chatting so much. Well, I mean, I need to chat with you guys, because so I think this is enough moisturizer. I'm just gonna, yeah. But I haven't done like, like a sit down makeup video with you guys in like forever it feels like i'm used to going live on tiktok and since tiktok is also possibly going away i feel like i should come back here oh i got a freaking pimple over here on my chest um i should come back to my old safe space which is youtube um and do some content for you guys um I do have some new followers on here, so hello to all my new followers. How are you doing? Um, yes. So we'll also do like probably some makeup transformations again, because that's what I used to do on here. I used to do like special effects makeup transformations, stuff like that. But I got kind of spoiled with TikTok where 
the live and everything you can go and have make or music or whatever with i think with youtube you can't have music or am i wrong you know somebody let me know in the comments below um okay now that my my uh, moisturizer is done i think i'm gonna and yeah i'm gonna start on my eyebrows um I do not know what color eyebrows to do. I think I might just, well, crap. That is a good question. I should just go with a neutral eyebrow. Okay, this is gonna be hard because I didn't think about this. Um, I do have a red eyebrow pomade, which my hair is gonna be red essentially, so maybe I should do red, but that's a lot. That's not really, I'm gonna do neutral actually. I'm gonna go in with my favorite pomade, which is a ginger pomade. And then I'm like, I think I'm gonna layer like a darker color on top. So let me do that. I do have this new little tool where you can actually, it's a spongy, it's kind of dirty because I can get all the stuff out, but whatevs. So I go, I, I go in with this stencil thing. I like using this recently. It's actually a really easy tool. And then like you can clean up the edges with like a Q-tip and some micellar water. And I just go in like this, twist it around, get enough product on it, and then go to town. So, uh, ah, it stuck to my face. Um, anyways, that's new with me. Um, yeah, I quit my job this past weekend just because many reasons. I used to work for Amazon. They, they don't really care about their employees like most places, but I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, it was just day after day, things would never get better. And you know, they would not communicate effectively with you, tell you what the changes were. They would never sit down and have meetings with the rest of the staff that works nights, which I work nights and say, hey, we're thinking about doing this. No, they would just go straight in and do it and say, you have no choice, which I'm like, uh-uh, I'm not doing that. You know what I mean? Like, that's not, that's not right, you know? Like, I feel that's not right. You know, I should have a choice and be like, hey, do you want to do this or do you not want to do this? Be like, no, I don't want to do this. I want to have options. And they didn't do that for me. And then also, yeah, there's just a lot with that job that I could go on and on and on about, but I'm not gonna. You guys are here for a hair vlog and maybe a little bit of makeup. So we're gonna do that. Um, Diana Brown's be slain. We got to get them slain. Um, I still have to pack a little bit for Disney. I have most of the stuff I'm packing for Disney. Um, <clears throat> I just have to pack like, you know, like the makeup I'm bringing. And, you know, my toiletries that I can't really pack right now because I'm using them, like my toothbrush and stuff like that. Um, I'm definitely bringing um, a curling iron because once I go to sleep, my new hair is going to get like, you know, it's not going to stay curly and stuff like that. Well, that's just how my hair is. Anyways, <clears throat> so let me get to this other eyebrow. It is always a struggle to get them even. I think that looks pretty even. And then she's gonna, I always like debate, like should I do my makeup or should I not do my makeup when I have a hair appointment? Cause you know, she's gonna do all kinds of stuff to my head and I don't know how the foundation, how the makeup's gonna stay, you know what I mean? But I'm like, screw it. Everybody I've ever seen that does hair vlogs or whatever, they always have their face done, so I want to look cute. That's pretty good. <coughs> Sorry. And you're seeing me in the raw right now. Ah! You're seeing me in the raw right now. No, not covered in makeup and stuff like that that I have been. So you get to see the real me. No filters or anything like that. You know what I mean? Um. I hope you guys, when I do post this, which I'm planning on trying to post it tonight before I go to bed, because I have to leave 
at like 7.30 to get the rental car. So, yeah. But this is going to be my son's first trip to Disneyland. I'm super, super excited for him. And as a mom, I get to see him light up for the very first time to see Disneyland. It's definitely going to be a little overwhelming for him, I think, because he is a little autistic. And he gets a little overwhelmed in crowded spaces. So we're going to have, I'm going to have to work with him on that. But he really wants to go, so it's not like it's my idea. Well, it is my idea, but he, he's been wanting to go for years. So, okay, so I'm going in with a little micellar water. Excuse me. I got my coffee this morning too. So we'll, we'll, we'll have the title of this video as a get ready with me slash hair vlog video or whatever. But like I said, I want to try. Does that look even? I don't know. <laughs> um, we're going to try to title this video as like a, a get ready with me hair vlog situa situation. Situation. Um, yeah. But I'm super excited for Disney, for my son. He's gonna love it. I have like a little Snapchat of him watching YouTube videos about Disney and I <clears throat> put a little text caption in there or whatever um, saying little does he know and this was like in December that he's going to Disneyland. It was like a, such a sweet moment. I need to post it somewhere and then say he's going today or whatever. I need to find it, which is going to be hard because I have to edit this video. <laughs> it might have to happen later. But I was like, yes, need to capture this moment because I know what I'm doing in the future. Or at least I knew I thought. Okay, I think the brows look pretty good. I'm going to, I, I could spend all day on my freaking brows. I tell you what, it's already been 12 minutes into this video. Let's move on. I think with this, it kind of keeps me accountable for the time a little bit. As to a live, they don't let you see what time it is if you're the host. On TikTok, anyways. I'm not sure how it is. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I'm not sure how it is on the YouTubes, the YouTubes. Alright. Anyways, let's get into... And this will help me to talk on my own because I'm used to talking with friends. Let's see. I'm trying to find my brush. I've washed a brush in like 20 brushes I've washed last night. <laughs> so many. Okay. So I got this little brush right here. This is like just a regular elf brush. And I'm going to go in with some concealer. Some elf concealer. I have a bunch more, but I'm just going to go in. It's all dirty. And I'm going to put some on the back of my hand just to warm it up a little bit also. And also it just, it's a place to put it. I'm going to have a little coffee break. It kind of looks like I have eye, a unibrow right now, but it's going to turn out. Woo! <clears throat> and I take it and I just kind of dip into it. Um, I feel like I find the washing machine and the dryer to be soothing sounds. I don't know. Okay, see. Uh, 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 uh. And then, like, I love doing that video with my best friend doing her Cheeto makeup. If you guys watched that, thank you for watching. Highly appreciate it. Um, we're gonna probably <clears throat> do more videos together. So, um, she is, not, I don't believe she has a YouTube channel, but she's um, on Instagram and TikTok. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, this is a little chunky. I don't know what's going on there. But I'm going to do, I'm kind of thinking of going for a little bit of a neutral look, which <clears throat> all my friends know that that is not my vibe. Okay. Needs to be cleaned up. Okay. So. And I 
know this color is not the right eyebrow color, but it just is, it goes with almost anything. I feel like I can experiment with the other eyebrow color once my hair is done. It's hard without no music, you know, y'all. I want that edge of the tail a little thicker. It's like not coming out the way I feel like I want it to come out. Anyways, that's what happens in makeup. Sometimes it doesn't. I don't know. I want this to be brought up. I don't want the harsh edge. <coughs> a little bit better. Okay, that's a bit better. Um. I think I might do like either one eye camera <clears throat> Let me know, you guys, if you guys want to see, like, a full look from start to finish. Like, eyebrows, eye, eyes, and then and then the base or whatever. Because some people do not like to see every step. And it kind of makes the video hella long. Because I'm like, if it's in real time, you know what I mean? Like, I'm used to not real time, especially with YouTube, with TikTok. Um, makes the video a lot longer, but, um, I'm down to do either or, but I appreciate feedback if you guys wouldn't mind providing that. Okay. And I'm also, I'm open to criticism. <clears throat> I'm not closed minded. So, so let's do the top with this brow and I think. I think for this video, I might just show you guys how to do one eye or whatever of what my look is going to be. And then um, I'll show you my outfit or whatever so we can move this video along. It's already 17 minutes long at this point, <laughs> which I can change. <laughs> now I'm gonna go in with this eyebrow stuff. This is like an eyebrow stamp or whatever. I'm just using this to lighten the front a little bit to fade it. And if you're a newbie with makeup, I highly suggest these, like little Q-tips. You could get Q-tips that are like round like this or Q-tips that are pointy like these for other uses. They're very useful. I didn't have them for years and I don't know why I don't have, I didn't have them. Anyways, all right. I feel like we're done with the brows. Um, we need to move on to the eyes. Okay. So like I said, I'm going to show you one eye, what I'm going to do. Um, <clears throat> and then I'm going to see. Um, and then I'll show you my outfit and then we'll be out the door. And the next time you'll see me, we'll be going in to get my hair done or getting a coffee or whatever. So that's my plan. Uh, what is on my face? Okay. Okay, so this is the Juvia's eye, eye, prep, eye Primer. I don't use uh, P. Louise just because it's, like, expensive and, like, it takes us a long time to get it. And uh, this is by Juvia's Place, and it works pretty freaking good. Like, I've never tried P. Louise, but maybe I will someday. Um, but this is what I'm using today to do my eyes. 
to lay down some primer. I like to go pretty far up. And I'm going with the Revolution Beauty. Sounds so sad. <clears throat> Cause right now it just creased a little bit already moving from one eye to the other one. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with, I think I'm gonna go in with this palette. This is my part, this is my Rock Candy palette by ColourPop. It is so pretty. Let's do a thumbnail. Because I need to, and I should have done it like when we stir started. It's right here. Um, yeah. Here, but I have them already. But um, I probably want to. I don't know. <laughs> so I'm just laying this in my crease. This is color, this color is called Erupt and it's in the Rock Candy palette. I'm just gonna lay this in my crease. I'm just kind of patting it right now. Um, and I'm just sweeping, sweeping it lightly. I like that kind of. I feel like there's a piece right here that, that wasn't covered. It, it's <laughs> cute, right? And then I think I want to go in with <coughs> a deeper color and then blend that out. Let's see. But this is really pretty, and then I could go over with a shimmer. Um, I'm gonna go in with these. It's called Strictly Tectonic. This black is going everywhere since I used it last time. Um. I hate it when I like your brushes just roll off the table. Okay. So I'm gonna go in with Strictly Tectonic. It's kind of like a brown color and I'm gonna use it to deepen that crease a little bit further. Okay. Uh, so much crap all over my desk. I'm gonna blend this out, smoke it out. With that same brush. Well, I'm trying to think if I should use a smaller brush. I should probably use a smaller brush. That one was a little bit big. Yeah, I'm gonna go in with, let's see. I just wanna use, sometimes you wanna use a shadow to blend out another shadow because it like, I don't know, okay. really pretty. This is called Cory Queen. I probably should use a brush, but eyeliner. 
the, for these purposes, this is the get, come with me hair vlog. So we're going to stop here and then I'll show you my outfit once I'm done with my makeup. Okay. So this is the makeup y'all. Um, I finished, <laughs> um, just want something simple. And, um, this is, I'll show you guys the dress. This is the dress. I have to go further back to show you. It's kind of long. It goes all the way down. And I'm wearing some hoops with it. And then I'm going to wear some, like, little chunkos that are sparkly. Look cute. So. Ah, crap. I'm off. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay. This has been such a long time coming. <laughs> I feel like Draco my Malfoy. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> so it's done. I just got finished, um, went to the bathroom. She left, um, but this is the final result. She did a color melt uh, of red into a uh, pink, which in this light, you can't really see to pink too much, but it is there. And then, see there's the pink right there, and then into an orange, which I love. I've always been orange before. But thank you so much for <laughs> coming along with me on my hair vlogish video. Get ready with me. Um, if you like this video and you want to see more, you want to hang out with me more, I'm going to possibly have Disney vlogs up or not up, but filming those very soon. Um, cause I'm going to Disneyland tomorrow or leaving for Disneyland tomorrow. But thanks for hanging out with me and getting ready with me and I'll see y'all later. Ta-da for now. Oh, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Bye.